Thank you. Well, it takes a lot of people to make sure the state of Ohio is a safe one. There are folks on the streets, others making sure kids get to school safely, and even more who look out for predators online. The common thread, they're all part of the Ohio State Highway Patrol, and they want you. Trooper Billy Watson and Trooper Josh Smith are here with us now. Uh, you might not even know that you're patrol material, so we're going to kind of give folks the rundown. <laughs> Good morning, gentlemen. Good morning. Thank you so much for being here today. Good morning. So Good morning. Uh, tell me a little bit about who you guys are looking for to, to join join the highway patrol oh, we're looking for eager men and women who all want to make the road safer I mean that's basically the bottom line um, I don't know if Trooper Smith has had the same idea but <laughs> but um, just people that want to have an eager and are willing to go out and want to and succeed and do well and help others and that's the main thing yeah so uh, somebody who maybe likes people too almost right? definitely most definitely <laughs> you work with people uh, pretty much every day, right? Yes, yeah, yes. Yeah. We're always coming in contact with people. Um, I know a lot of people think that all we do is mainly just, you know, we're writing tickets and all mm -hmm. that, but there's more to that. <laughs> I mean, we handle crashes. Um, mm -hmm. we, we deal with people as far as, you know, um, uh, just, you know, they're going through some crises or things mm -hmm. of that nature, you know. Those things that happen. When someone's tire goes flat and they're on the roadside, they, they see us and there's that look at, like, <sighs> a little bit of relief, right? You know, yeah. so um, and that, and that's to me that's it's it's enjoyable. It's great. I like it. it's good. It's a good feeling. Be yeah, able to help folks out. Most so uh, there's and when you talked about the things that you do on the road, different types of jobs on the road, but there are different types of jobs maybe back at the office or other kind of opportunities for people. Absolutely. One of the big things for me, um, the reason I want to be with the patrol is the opportunities that are present within the division um, itself. So. Um, like Trooper Watson said here, sometimes most people are familiar with us being on the side of the road mm -hmm. working. Um, there's a lot of other opportunities within the division, whether it be at our training academy, um, special response team. Yeah. Um, we have detectives, investigators, crash specialists. Um, so we have a lot of opportunities throughout the division. Aviation as well is one of the oh, big ones. Okay. We have a lot of opportunities without, throughout the division that some people aren't familiar with. Even executive protection, you know, we have those. So do people that actually look over the you know security for the governor so mm -hmm. um, yeah just numerous opportunities that's pretty cool <laughs> yeah oh yeah so what are the requirements for folks um, uh, to to sign on I would imagine they have to go through the Academy no matter yes yes like first that. of all you have to be between 20 and 34 years of age okay. um, you have a GED or G, GD or a high school diploma okay. um, you also um, have to have a valid driver's license that's very important mm, yeah, you're that's what we do. right right <laughs> um, and uh, you know like I said again we just just you're eager and willing to uh, want to go out and work want to work hard and like I said not only just help but you're protecting too you know mm -hmm. and your service we're that's what we are we're a service mm -hmm. so. so the Academy um, we've heard uh, people here locally with local <laughs> police departments having a hard time with that yes you have your own Academy right yes is it pretty pretty difficult <laughs> The Academy for the Seattle Patrol, it's located in Columbus. Mm -hmm. um, it is challenging. Mm -hmm. It's uh, challenging for a reason. The, the job has challenges throughout mm -hmm. the job right. um, and career choice. So what we try to do in our training is implement those challenges within the training. Mm -hmm. uh, and that just shows individuals and can grow the different skill sets needed for the position. Right. Um, our Academy, like I said, it's in Columbus. It's, mm -hmm. it's 24 to 26 weeks. Okay. Um, cadets do live there Monday through Friday. Uh, you do come home on the weekends and mm -hmm. on holidays. Um, you're also compensated while you're there. So it's a really yeah. good opportunity in that sense. It's great training. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. And it's paramilitary, so. <laughs> so definitely it's not, it's not going to be easy. Mm -hmm. But again, like, like uh, Trooper Smith was saying, you know, those are things that we're going to try to prepare you for out there in the field. I mean, obviously we have to as best we can give scenarios that are going to give you a situation mm -hmm. that you might, you know, come to. So. You want to be prepared. You want to feel prepared exactly. when you're going to be, you know, out exactly. there uh, exactly. on your own, right? right. Yes. And, and right. obviously the citizens <laughs> oh, yeah. want that want that as well. Most definitely. Uh, so what do people need to do if they're interested? How do they get? Well, first up? thing you want to do is go to our website, statepatrol.ohio.gov. Um, on there, it's really self, pretty much self-explanatory. You'll fill out, um, you, you'll actually fill out an application on there because you'll then it'll tab. You go to careers.ohio.gov. Mm -hmm. Just fill out the information. And it'll just walk you step by step through. It's really simple, um, especially for the people out there now, younger people. Man, they're they're really savvy when it comes to that kind of stuff. So, mm -hmm. um, and, and definitely if they need to get a hold of us, uh, you know, we're actually we're regional so mm -hmm. you can see each person is like hey if this is the county that you're yeah. in they can okay. contact me as a recruiter okay. or contact trooper smith and we're really good about getting back with people so if they have any questions or any or questions anything yes. Like that. yes what if somebody has some background in law enforcement maybe they've been to they've passed another academy okay. they would still have to go through the the patrols academy right Correct. Um, with the State Highway Patrol, all of our officers go through the academy. It's important for a couple different reasons. One of the main reasons is 
certain situations, all officers are going to be trained the same. Mm -hmm. um, so I know exactly how Trooper Watson's going to react in a situation. Mm -hmm. We work well together okay. in that sense. Mm -hmm. um, but uh, individuals with other experience mm -hmm. in law enforcement do have to attend our academy. Mm -hmm. But they'll be have a little leg up probably, you know? Yes, <laughs> oh, definitely. It be, definitely helps. Uh, yes. um, I mean, especially, you know, because those people that have, have prior, they're going to know what it's like to actually, you know, talk to people mm -hmm. and, and things of that nature. So mm -hmm. it does make it, it does make it easy. Definitely would want anyone, you know, that is prior, has prior or not, we, you know, we want you to be a part of it. So. All right. So you can get online, get going. And, and lastly, what do you, gentlemen, what do you love so much about being on the highway patrol? Again, for me, it's just, I love the, the service part of it. Um, I feel like that's what I'm here for, was mm -hmm. to serve. Um, never thought about anything else, but trying to help people and serve people and do what I can and to make, uh, make the, the state of Ohio better, the country better. And this is kind of my way of doing it. Mm -hmm. So. Mm -hmm. To kind of go off what Trooper Watson said, it, and personally, it's self-fulfilling to be out there making a difference, mm -hmm. um, making a difference with our organization's professionalism and is part of it, the opportunities that the division presents um, as well. But being able to, to go out into the community and make a difference, every day is a little bit different, mm -hmm. obviously, what we come across or handle. Right. Um, and I like that element as well. Yeah, so this might be right up your alley, something you say, you know what, that sounds really good. Get online, uh, get the process started, and you might have a new career ahead of you. Yes. Gentlemen, thank you so much for coming in today. Thank and you for your thank time. And thank you for, for serving and protecting us. We appreciate, appreciate it, man. That thank you for your time. Yep.